Today, we're introducing the vicinity bus to the community in the city of Prince George. What it is, this is a new vehicle, new innovative vehicle. that's smaller than the traditional 40-foot bus. It's 27 and a half feet long. And really, what are we testing? We're testing a new type of vehicle that we can bring into more residential areas. One of the biggest challenges we have with transit is convenience. People are saying and telling us that, well, we don't take transit because it doesn't come to my area. Well, what we want to do is we want to bring in a vehicle that is acceptable and that fits within the community and the neighborhoods. So that's what we've done. We've gone out and we've searched pretty far and wide for a vehicle that uh, is smaller, more narrow, and is accepting to the customer, but still has all the characteristics that you would traditionally see on a 40-foot bus. So it's got the traditional seats, it's got the door, it's also got the ability to lower the bus, it's got the ramp, it's got that versatility and the flexibility that you see within a 40-foot bus. The vicinity bus is half the price of a, tra uh, t a traditional 40-foot bus. It's 33% more fuel efficient. So as communities look to try to introduce transit, it gives them an affordable option that they've never had in the past. I mean, we've had it in Quinell, Squamish and the Cowichan Valley and we've had a lot of positive comments but we've also had a lot of feedback and elements of things that we can do to improve the vehicle and that's what we're asking the people of Prince George to do. Give us some, some feedback. We really want to make this a vehicle that you know if you see it on the streets in Prince George and we expect to see this in the future on the streets of, of Prince George that uh, it's something that they've had input into.